Hi YouTube viewers, welcome back to my next video on JNT Labs. In this video, I am going to tell you how to install multi-sim in your PC or your computer. So basically, the link will be provided in the description. Just go there, download it, and then you watch this video how to install it. So you will you will get this kind of setup. I will be providing you the rare file. Just extract the rare file, and then you you will get this kind of files in front of you, and then click hit the setup button double click the setup button and write the name and your organization nothing but for your home purpose i am using it here just write it home don't write a serial number you press it no and then click on next be sure that you have no internet connection when the at the time of installation be sure that you have no internet connection if you have internet connection please disconnect it and then install it okay so it takes a maximum of one hour time to complete this overall installation process for uh, i will pause this video for some time then again i will be starting this video when it reaches to 95 percent so it will be helpful for you so in my you can see in my channel the previous video of one i have kept here about the basic video which was our registers three registers and some voltage was present so after that uh, what i have done is the current uh, what is the current in that circuit I have told you and what is what was the voltage in the circuit I have told you and those all things I have told you right there how to connect those and everything I have explained there so basically remember friends current will always flow in current in a series connection will be constant and the voltage in parallel will be a constant one and remaining things will be differs okay current will get deviated from at the node okay so those things we'll be discussing later on I am telling this because one of my subs, one of my channel who has seen my video of it has commented that something nonsense he has commented. Uh, commented. So for him, I am telling this all this all the things. Basically, first of all, you learn the basics. He will be learning in intermediate basics is enough, more than enough for me for this channel. If you know the intermediate basics, the current dividing KCL and KVL rules, those things, then it's better. Then you can understand my these videos. Otherwise, you have to learn those things, and then you have to see how this all works and how to do the simulation. This kind of things. So basically, these videos are for simulating part. Means we don't have components to buy. We if you have components, you need, you have to go to market and you have to buy it. You have to invest money, right? And after investing money, you will be not be getting your output exact output what you have required, what you was thought then it is waste of money and waste of time so for those kind of things what i can able to do i can just install this ni national instruments this is nothing but ni is a company name which is pro provided this software multisim it provides lab view software also where we can able to simply you have to drag and drop the components and then you have to connect it similar kind of thing they have given and they are doing a good better things they are doing if you want lab view videos also i can provide you lab view videos just comment it below comment below if you don't know about lab view just research on it um, because hope that you are gentle students you will be learning more because te technology is growing more and more still if you are in multi sim then multi sim and arduino these kind of things you have to buy the hardware and then you have to commit and you have to do perform the operation but if you go for that lab view directly the code will be working you will you have to not write the code at all just you have to put some delay you will, you will be getting some delay blocks you there you are you will be getting delay box you will be getting a switch switches automatic switches and all the things you will be getting you just you have to connect it and you have to tell how much delay you want and what the things to on when to on how to on those kind of things so many projects can be done there by using it robotics also can be done by using that lab view simple things if you know embedded I have uploaded so many videos on embedded also if you want to learn the embedded systems you can go there and you can learn it now basically we will be looking into a multi sim concept and also the labs which you are going there we will be seeing those things so basically the the videos will be of two parts similarly in my embedded system you have seen that the videos are three parts similarly here it will be two parts first part will be our component placing and your output verify then we will be discussing why we are using this component where we can use this up component nothing but applications first of all when you go to lab they will be giving that uh, title you have to do this experiment today 
so similar kind of thing we will be going here also we will be doing then we will be learning what are the applications of it in my next videos okay so we will be having 12 laps so okay 12 weeks you will be having 12 laps right so similar kind of 12 videos we will be getting here also same kind of thing you will be getting and also i will be giving some basic stuff to you in five four to five videos i will be giving a, giving a basic concept how to use this all components so four videos we will be leaving off and next 12 which are the lab cycles so we will be discussing those lab experiments 12 lab experiments by using this multi sim so for 12 videos you will be having two videos because one will be your circuit uh, implementation and output verifying then you will be getting your next is application parts and where where it where it can be used and what what will be your viva questions depending on this circuit or depending on this experiment those thing so 24 videos there and we have 5 videos or 6 videos are here overall 30 videos we will be presenting in our multi sim ok so we, first video i have already uploaded in your in the youtube you can check the links below in the description also i will be providing or, or else i will be providing at the end of the video you can have a look of it so I have, we have completed 68 percentage anyhow let me pause this video for some time and then we, are, we, we will be starting basically you can able to see that installation has been completed here so just click on next and don't launch the application ok so after clicking next you will be seeing here check their updates any updates available and i click it no ok no updates should we need to check it ask you to restart your system since i am making the video i am not restarting it i am restarting it later ok but you need to restart it again ok because if i stop it the video will be paused and it will be half so that's the reason i am not restarting it open your license activator click on double click on it and just right click on it and then click on full addition or you can right click on it and you can tell ok i don't want a basic addition so that's the reason i have not using then go and click on activate ok just click on activate it will be activating ok Gener if you click on generate license number it will generate a random number don't click on it just click on activate that's it just afterwards close it you can able to fire you can able to see a small multi sim in national instruments circuit design multi sim just double click on it and open it you can able to see that the pro edition has been given to you professional edition has been in, has been installed in you okay and you will be getting this kind of interface you can go to help about multi sim you can have then application build date okay these all things will be present so hope this video is very helpful for you and if you want more videos on it just subscribe my channel share with your friends so that your your classmate or a schoolmate or anyone any of your friend will be liking this video and he'll be learning something if he's interested or passionate about electronics electronics for you thank you